Welcome everyone to Planet Papas. This evening, we are here in Lamai. We're going to be taking a long walk tonight, showing you the whole strip of Lamai, starting from here at the new 7-Eleven. We're going to go all the way down to the end. I'd just also like to say, happy birthday to my brother Andy in Canada. He's enjoying that beautiful weather down there while after supper here on Samui. So the only thing we could do is enjoy where we are in life. So you, me, let's go! This is the new 7-Eleven. They put a five star, so if you're looking for some chicken, we're right on the corner where you turn into of the McDonald's. I will be walking through all of Lamai, so it's going to be a long video just showing you all the restaurants, all the bars, where to eat, where not to eat, where you can drink, where you can sleep. So it's going to be just a nice, easy walk all the way down. So going back years ago, this area used to be very popular around the corner. And now it's very, very quiet. Oh, there's a few places closed on Wednesday. There you go. Restaurant I never tried yet is called Nana Tam Restaurant. gym that's been here forever. It's called the Altered Fitness. Ultra Bodies Fitness. I think it's been here for over 20-30 years for sure. So there are two Pizza de Souls here. There's a name game fight for it. These guys are supposed to change their name. Not sure what's going on, but there's one here and at the end of Lamai as well. If you're looking for some Thai boxing equipment and also t-shirts, party tricks, UFC stuff, Thai boxing. Coming up to the Lamai Market. We've been around for many, many years. A lot of cars here, isn't it? This is their night market. Usually always busy, busy.
It's still early, it's only quarter past six. I came before it gets pretty crazy later on. So there's many restaurant choices here as well in the market. You can see they got the live band in the back ready for tonight. It's a smaller market, but it's always busy here. Get some nice things on a stick, some fish. 250 fish, that's very cheap. Sushi, sodika. <laughs> no, no, thank you very much. I <laughs> go sticky rice. Pizza. Many big things on a stick. Lots of things on a stick. Wings. Whoa, here comes many sticks. And that's the market. It's very crazy later on today. So this gives you an idea where you are. If you did stay at the pavilion, you're only maybe a three minute walk to the market and a good five to 10 minutes to the middle of the main area of Lamai. we're gonna go across to look at Annie if you are a vegan vegetarian no sugar Annie is a great place for you to come to to get your sweets on to get good food vegan style and it's right beside the door and the door is very popular for the beach bar and swimming pool so these two are right beside each other you can party like a vegan and drink like a vegetarian I don't know that doesn't work Go past Kom Shiswa. This is new. The very Mexican bistro. This looks very new to me. Yeah, so they do have a, another one in Copenhagen that's been open for two years and this one has been open for eight months. First time I've seen it. And an oldie but a goodie is the Marine Bar. And for the ladies, a little special place called Samui Hot Club. You can get so many different styles here of clothing for beach wear, summer wear. Because I know some of my subscribers, they actually pause the video to see what's available in the shop. So I'll go a little slower for you in here. There's many styles, you got the old school Samui shirts. Bikinis and many things. Perfect. And don't worry, across the street is a bar for you guys to have a fresh coconut while you wait. Corio Restaurante Italiano and of course Tendori Nights Indiano. And if you like Harry Potter, you like Harry's Restaurant. 
I don't know how magical it is, I haven't been there yet, so nothing to say. There are two very popular bars on the Strip. One is called Lamai Cocktails. They have some great memorabilia from the Hulk to Iron Man to all those superheroes you love so much. You sit there, have a drink, and enjoy really some cool music. There's one here and near the end of Lamai as well. And right beside across the street is Silver. So if you're looking for some wicked homemade silver, you come in here. Boom Bums Corner. This place is always busy. And a great idea they just opened up recently is Mr. Joe, so you can do your washing here. Doesn't take long, it's around 26 minutes to wash, 28 minutes to dry, one hour you have fresh, crisp, clean clothes. Monica, how are you? <laughs> so there are a few subscribers that asked me where can you find men's clothing and there are a few places like 69 Siam which is across here and then there's called, depending on what you're looking for, there's a place called uh, Pranano and they do have designer, t-shirts, shorts, swimwear, even winter coats. So if you want to go back home in style you can get one of those as well. There's not so many designer places here, but there are a few. There's a few on Shuang Beach as well. Now we're in front of the Weekender. I did a hotel review here as well. You want to check that out. The Weekender is very close to the middle of everything in Lamar. Sorry, mate. <laughs> okay, I almost got hit by a bike there. My fault. We're in front of Salto, which is a European restaurant. Seventy Fahrenheit and across the Italian restaurant called Tropicana. And another Italian restaurant called Pizza <laughs> Pizza Napolia. It's still very early for this end of the strip, but every Saturday night, in between all these bars, so <laughs> 
is the boxing ring. And this starts around 10, 10.30. They do have local fights as well. You're gonna see younger kids, and then they go into mid-teenagers, and then some of you adult fights. So every Saturday night around 10, 10.30 is free. You just gotta buy a drink, and they put chairs all around the ring, and just enjoy the night. It's really cool. So you don't have to go to the stadium and pay two to 3,000 baht. You just pay for one drink, which costs you 150 at the most. So leaving the ring area, we go across to a little bit of a market. Newer place that opened out called Club Sandwich. Haven't been there yet. There's a lick bar. We do have an Italian place as well. Lasagna, good top. Many things on SD. So really that's only the two markets. It's the night market at the end, the market here near the actual ring, the Thai boxing ring. And live music rock and roll is at the Bondi. Get your Maccas on. And another vegetarian place called Diddy's Falafel. Sorry, Dodi's Falafel. walking down the street I just want to say a few things where it is harder for me to do hotel tours at the moment because most of the places are completely full so we'll be doing more hotel stuff probably in March April for sure hello. how are you, you want to say hello hello everybody ah, welcome welcome <laughs> Okay, now we're in front of the Tumblr bar, which is recently opened. And it is quarter past seven. I took a little break. Wanted to show you how busy it gets a little later. As we're in front of Cocktails by Pick, a newer bar. Same owners as the Lamai at the end of the street. In front of the Salatai, always popular with the locals and the tourists. Cafe Noir. And a great place to sit down, relax, people watch, is Let Them Chill. Owned by a Canadian owner, really nice guy. Great place to chill. I met some subscribers from Ireland. Good to meet you here. Best time to come. From Kelly's Tavern. That baby needs to change his face. Okay, they did change this. 
Now it is called Soy Five Local Sushi. Hello, Hello everyone. Sushi. How long you been open now? Two weeks, three weeks. Three weeks, two yeah. weeks. Very nice. So it's all Japanese? All sushi? Yes. All right. Let's have a look at the menu. Salad, nigiri, maki rolls, tempura, all sushi, very nice, very new opening, called Soy Pai. And we are to Pizza to Seoul, part two, the one I reviewed as well. Of peri peri chicken, and we're heading toward all the bars and little clubs. Another great place to come to, obviously, it's way too early, it's only 7 15. Is the Thirsty Viking, one of the better bars here in Lamai. They always have some pool tournaments going on. Some amazing staff. I'll try that again. Some amazing staff, really, really relaxed atmosphere, very friendly. Great place to have a drink and get to know the owner. That, that is speed, always with the live bands. We're going past Eldora. This will get quite busy after 9 or 10. Oscar bar, Suda bar, Peacock bar, Bagel bar, Hansen's bar, and a bike heading to a bar. Sodika, how are you? And now we're passing a place that do have old school English called Gao Badger. Ate here before. They've been here for many, many, many years. There's a Balinese restaurant. Another English pub called the Kadwapa. I haven't been here yet either. But they have the roasts on Sunday and their English breakfast. We're going to head down to another place. They own Shiba's Samui Beach Club, but they do have another restaurant here called Taps. We're going to say hello. Here we are in front of Taps. Sadikav, how are you? Everything okay? <laughs> it's really early, so nothing's going on yet, but the great staff are here ready for you. All Taps. And Taps got a new chef. So they're doing an all-day breakfast and also they're doing the burger and fries, tapas, gut bruster, a double burger, only for $2.40. Now that is a great deal. It is getting in the end of February, so we're going to be looking at March, April. We're going to do a lot more on this channel. Now that the tourist and the heavy tourist season is almost over, we can start going back to the places where I want to show you. At the moment, it was just too many people. I couldn't show you properly of the places I wanted to see and wanted to show you as well. So now, we are going to go full speed ahead on Planet Poppers. So in front of us is Peri Peri. 
And we're going to be walking straight to the end as well. And across the road, we looked at it before, was the Oyster Bar. And the shucking hours are from 6 p.m. to 11.30 at night. There are so many restaurants here in Samui. It sounds like I've been to none of them. But you just can't keep up. There's more some people, sorry. There's more restaurants than people, I think, in the whole of Thailand. Kangaroo restaurant. Looks busy. <laughs> yeah. Very busy, called Lamai Will Wait. Oh, ho, ho. they might be connected to Shawang Will Wait. So there must be three. That's a lot of waiting. Three times the wait. And another Italian restaurant called Maza. Pizza, pasta, antipasta. Japanese restaurant recently opened up called Okana Sushi Bar. <laughs> and one famous on the island called Salt. Now in front of Mira Marie. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I hope he's singing his soprano tonight. Getting his voice ready. The Good Life Bar. And if any of you know that song, Riverside! I heard many good things of the Black Olives Bar and Grill. As we pass Aloha Hotel Resort. And now we're going to the Chinese cuisine, to Chinese Thai. And the cat bar. As we come around the corner to the end of this whole beautiful, sensational, wonderful filming of Lamai. Another interesting thing that's been happening on Samoy, it is hard to get out of here. People can't find flights, last minute flights to even going to Pattaya, to Bangkok, 
because all the flights are full. So we know it's crazy busy, but there's just not enough flights for us to go in and out of Samui. Okay, okay, it's time to wake up. So thank you for joining me here today on Planet Papas. We'll see you tomorrow. So don't forget to like, subscribe, share the videos, and make sure when you're here to change your face. I've seen a lot of people today on the beach that the face did not change. Change them up. So thank you, take care, and see you soon.